Welcome to Day Job. I am your host, Code Marvelous, and we're here on Thursday. Playing a little bit more. Day job. Oh, I freedom. Am your host, Code Marvelous. Oh. So let's see if we can find ourselves a game. Let me get the the deck. I'm borrowing a deck from um, Ben Nee. Let me get the list in there while we're waiting. Uh, the only thing I changed here is I added in why is it not submitting hang on I don't know what's going on with Nightbot. That was weird. The only thing I changed is I put in Yusuf's. That should fix it. All right. So first things first, let's drop Yusuf. Let's dirty laundry into R&D. Thank you. Go again. Let's go again. It's mining accident. Alright, we, so we gotta ditch three tags there. So we don't get boomed. We'll force that to be rezzed, whatever that is. Sneaky Atlas. All right, we're alive and kicking, and we're at five points. Yeah, generally speaking, what I've learned is when people hard hitting and then do that type of play, they're trying to like cheat out a really good agenda hoping that you'll be nervous but sometimes you gotta just go for it all right so let's draw 
Let's draw again. Let's get some bucks. HQ. Let's go into R and D. And that's game. Good game. So a lot of times, I mean we got very lucky here, but a lot of times with these style uh uh combo decks uh sure uh you just have to make them waste money Mining accident, great card. Don't let anybody tell you otherwise. I think in that last game, our opponent went for the, um, our opponent went for the, um, the hard hitting news. And I don't think, I think maybe they like didn't have anything to follow up. So it wasn't, so they broke, kind of broke their bank. I mean, we don't know if they had boom in their hand actually, so I can't really speak to that. Good morning, James. Peddler. Um. So before the turn starts, let's get the daily cast off of there. Let's get another daily cast down. Let's put another peddler down. And get some money. No, I, you're sneezing a lot, buddy. So I don't want you up near my coffee because I like to drink that coffee. Let's get the liberated account down. Let's go in. Wow. 
David. Good card. Don't let anybody make you not think David's a good card. Anansi. Well, I think that's just game. I think we just lost, right? Actually, we'll be fine. Perfect. Thank you for the bad daughter. Why are you so sneezy, man? You're right. You allergic to yourself? All right. There's the mimic we need, but we also really need um. We also desperately need Data Sucker. Oh, and I'll just trash that. No, this is the... Yes, this is the one I played against you. Oh, that's a cool play. Alright. So let's draw draw again. Uh, let's see what's behind HQ. We really need um, Data Sucker like very badly or we are going to lose this game. There's only eight cards left. Hopefully we'll find one soon because otherwise we just can never contest that server. threat. Welcome, Russell. It's good to see you.
Hey, good thing we help, held that other hunt, uh, Yusuf in reserve. Because now we're not completely screwed. And that's two precious clicks that they could be using to score out that they now don't have. So let's draw. Yeah, now we're cooking. Yeah, I mean, Archer is incredible. It's like, it's not like we're playing my smoke deck where I'm breaking it for two imaginary dollars. check that. I guess that's the question. Good game. So this guy uh, played well both times, but he asked for a rematch, and you know, this Jemison deck really relies on being able to slow me down enough to be able to do the 24-7 combo and stuff, and by giving me the two bad pub, he just made the whoredoms trivial. And then I would still be able to do this and then go in there. Alright, let's take a look at the build real quick. Because this build... Um, does not have um, an MK, any MKs. Um, it runs off of two Mimics and Data Suckers, which, and it has a Backup David, which, Backup David, it's very good. Um, but it's, it's rough sometimes. Um, I might get another MK in there just to see how it feels, and then we can always take it out later, because I feel like leaning heavily on the Mimic is something that only um, Ben Nee can do. Um, I'm not that good. So yeah, we're making we're making the Code Marvelous edits to uh, a really good deck, but it's, it's working really well for me. What I'm noticing is much like... Um, noise where uh, people think he's easier than he is um, there's a lot going on beneath the surface of like how you decide what you're doing hmm I don't know if I like this hand I think I'd prefer some more accelerant Hey, you're the one who jumped down, man. You also sneezed on me, like, a ton of times this morning. What's your deal? Ah, let's get you up here. Okay. So, let's run R&D. Let's mining accident while the mining accident is good. Let's put that down. Um... Should I try to force the res here? Yeah, let's force the res.
Hey, you earned it. Ah, uh, it was all for naught. Oh well. Well, this makes things easy. I made some modifications, like most notably I added Yusuf's, because I, I think that it's, it's um, Freedom's best card. I reduced the number of stim hacks. Oof. Welcome to Luck Luxat Country. Oh, we're so dead. Good game. Yep, you can also say um, Netrunner to get more information about Netrunner or pull the FAQ with the timing structure. It's pretty good. Here, let's jump in. I want to switch to my smoke deck. But yeah, I'm excited. Twitch time. You got that prime sub. And you want the sweet balder amount. Houdini. Oh no. I'm not going to use Houdini until we have to. I'm on Refractor, especially now that the uh, Gebrolasi. came out. It's good. Well, yeah, won't so. I made a deck once that only had Fairchild Ice in it, and I had a picture of. Um, um, Maud Flanders with won't someone please think of the fair children um I don't like this hand let's mulligan it that's better good luck have fun How's everybody else's freedom testing going? Anybody come across anything that they're particularly fond of? Gotta get those drips going.
Yeah, that would make sense. Um, extra preemptives. Uh, on the mod, or aunt, he mod, uh, uh, you're Josiah, right? You earned it. Uh, I think the real problem that we're having with freedom, and it came up when Kevin Tame um, and uh, Jeff Strube were trying to um, help me build my original version of freedom, is that like there are so many viruses that are so good to have in him, and you you just you just don't have the room, like. Gang sign freedom. What an interesting idea, because then you can use the virus counters to trash off turn. That's a neat idea. an interesting turn we just had hopefully we don't get punitive also we're not really doing anything particularly smoky right now we're just sieging with mom that would be interesting card type oof whiff city oh my god am i gonna get hit with a salem a salem's hospitality oh my god if they if they do salem's salem's hospitality for a refractor i'll be so proud of them So let's put down no one home. And then let's run R&D and get our trigger. Yeah, I, I'm going to work on that dull fork, definitely. archives ma is a good card it's a very good card yeah I mean I'm gonna be experimenting with freedom a lot lately um, I'm also cooking up some spicy some spicy corp business um, but yeah, I think what I'm going to do is, is most days of the week, I'm going to try to focus on one build and then on Friday, I'm going to do like a variety stream where I play a different deck every game.
They're... I have a bold prediction. Father, what, what, are, you, what are you doing? You're licking, you're licking my leg. Okay. That's what you're into. All right. We need a Netmerker. Netmerker is a really solid, a really solid smoke card. They can't trash your deck if you're already trash. Um, I think Russell, well, Russell and I had a great game uh, on my lunchtime yesterday, but also, um, if anybody watched the earlier Freedom Streams, like, if you really get rolling with the viruses, like, you can get a corp down to, like, less than 10 cards in their deck super fast, especially if you're also running Imp. It's wild. Come on, deck. Like, when you really get going with freedom, it's really crazy. Um, how quickly you can just start shredding R&D if you have Imp and his ability and the mining accidents to do normal trashes. Like, he becomes, like, Ultra Wizard. I really want to appreciate... I really want to take a moment to appreciate everybody that's embraced the shift for us moving the stream to um, Twitch because it's been a lot better for me from a content generation perspective. The interface for Twitch is a lot more intuitive. It's a lot more e easy. It's a lot easier for me to um, it's a lot easier for me to uh, Oh, a, a Chief Slee deck. So, we'll just take the indexing and try to end it next turn. Yeah, well, that's where all the replays go. Um, all the replays go onto YouTube. I mean, I can put the chat bubble up here uh, for Twitch, and then that way people can see it on the YouTube. All right. Let's end it. Oh my god, there was no 
agendas in there? Well, I guess we just lose. Only 18 cards left in the deck. Yeah, that's a uh, that's an agenda. So good game. Yeah, let me let me fix that real quick. I was just reticent uh, to do a chat box. When I've already got a chat going. thing about doing chat boxes here is that um, there's no like clear place for it to go um, but that way the chat will be on the replay all right let's go back to freedom So we're two and one with freedom, and we're one and zero with smoke. I feel like we're still a little light on people. I guess I need to get the word out to more of like the European people somehow that the um, the streams have been moved. Mm, that's a bad hand. That's not much better. Keep drawn. Of course, since we are playing against somebody who's on scarcity, we draw like the only resources we have right away. I don't know. Um, I don't. Might not have been the correct choice. All right.
I actually faced this guy the other day, um, and um, I forgot to put him on my do not play list, but hopefully he'll be better this time. Actually, forgot I brought that up. That's not something that's appropriate for me to bring up if I didn't do anything about it. Cool, you got me. Um, we're, ne we're never gonna have this scarcity cleared. We gotta get Knob down. Because consumes our late game economy. Yeah, I mean, the the burden here is definitely on them. operation um, yeah that's a full operation street peddler
That turn one scarcity is gonna get ya. All right. Rad. Two free agendas for our opponent. Sounds great. Yeah, I don't know what we're going to do here. Because um, we don't have a meaningful way to get economy. Um, so I guess we just wait until they're forced to score. Which is a really boring way to win. No, I've been I've been using consume to make money, James. Yeah, I mean, so, uh, not in yellow, I don't think. of counters we're gonna toggle auto and we'll gain money Let's see if we can get some ice rest.
All right. Let's draw. Money up. I mean, I, I really don't think we have to run until something goes into that server. Do you guys hear that balder purring? My sweet boy. All right. Um. Let's go R and D. That's probably where the other Raven is. It's a good one to steal. Gain two bucks. Gain more bucks. Oh yeah, overdraw. I'll check that. And there's the quit. Okay, so we're still doing that apparently. Right. That's what happened the other time I played him is, is I, he's playing these types of lock NBN decks and when I wouldn't play into uh, what he was doing, he just quit. Um, so, I don't need you coming on the show. Alright, wow, it's almost uh, 7.30. So, we went 3-1 and one with Freedom. That's really good. Um, and we went 1-0 uh, and zero with Smoke. So, we're getting there with new cards. New cards, ahoy. Uh, Argus. I'm liking Argus and Titan. Um, Jinteki is really good. I just... Balder. I just can't really play Jinteki. I suck real bad at playing red. Um, yeah, this, this deck's a, a ton of fun. And it's really interesting and challenging to play. Man, we need currents. Um...
Um, I'd probably cut like a stim hack and like a dirty laundry to get in two hacktivist meetings. Oh yeah, Argus is hilarious um, against certain builds. Uh, then other builds, uh, you just don't you just don't care at all about Argus's identity ability. Um, like in, uh, I played a counter surveillance um, Max against an Argus deck, and I was just like, oh, is that a standoff? Hum num 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 num, free tag. Like, it it's so good. Um. I mean, Bagat's a, Bagat is a cut, I think, that I could make. It's great when it's down, but I don't. I find myself not having the time to install it a lot of the time. Um, it's great pressure, so that could definitely become a hacktivist. Um, and hacktivist serves a similar function in that it's, it's trashing cards. And uh, that they don't have control over or can't see um but yeah i mean we could we could do rumor mill rumor mill's a fine card it's good for what ails you um so let's do that um Go down to one mimic, do rumor mill. Yeah, that seems good. Yeah, we'll give that, we'll do at least one game with that tomorrow. All right, everybody. Thanks very much for hanging out. I always appreciate everybody taking time out of their day to come watch me play Netrunner. And uh, if you don't already, follow. Um, and if you've got like an Amazon subscription or want to throw me some cash, there's a subscribe button so you can get the Sweet Balder emote. Um, more details on the modded league probably coming next week. And I might start doing a couple of modded games or do like uh, two days a week where I do the modded format. So hopefully all of you can give me some feedback on what you guys and girls think about that. And until I see all of you again, always be running.